What's up everybody, 915 Mang here. Gonna do a video today and we're gonna talk about a few things. I know that you're looking at this video and you're like, man, this is 915 Mag's barbecue grill. But the thing about barbecue grill, the way that I do it, having a smoker, it takes time to have a good food for everything to come out nice. You can't be rushing things. You can't be trying to cook fast, anything like that because it's gonna come out like crap. So with that, just like your reef tank, you got to take your time, guys. You got to really take your time and think about things. You go out and you want to buy lights. Well, some of the things that you need to consider about your lights are the percentages, the height, how many hours of light, how you're going to acclimate your corals. You got to start low and slow, just like cooking. Another thing to think about is mechanical filtration. Are you going to do GFO? Are you going to do carbon? Carbon dosing? Vinegar? You can't you can't just be going all hardcore with the GFO and expect the algae to get cleared out overnight. I know you guys go online and you look at these reef tank calculators, right? And you go by the recommended dose, but you need to go half of that, if anything. You can't just go, you know, hardcore like the way that it's recommending um, some things to think about also is dosing you got to think about your alkalinity your calcium magnesium uh, what kind of supplements are you going to use what kind of two-part um, things like that so you got to really consider what you want to do because just like a reef tank and barbecue it's like the same thing it takes patience if you go out fishing you really got to take your time because that thing can take you all day to catch one little fish this video I'm trying to help you guys out to kind of remind you guys that this is one of those hobbies that's rewarding it's not gonna happen overnight and you do got to take your time with it you know just because you have a you see people with this awesome reef tank it didn't just happen after overnight what does happen overnight is bad things what doesn't happen overnight is progress and that takes a lot of time like going back to the topic of fish you know you might want to have this fish or ras fish um you know some tangs you might want to have all your fish at once but i gotta break it to you you gotta take your time you gotta add a few fish at a time you can't be stocking out of control you gotta wait for the cycle to happen for the bacteria to kick in for the net um, the nitrifying bacteria you got to find a good LFS that's going to explain this to you and take the time to pick their brain and see give you some recommendations I mean you can always hit me up ask me questions drop the comments below and I'll get back with you and I'll answer you um, but the thing is this whole thing takes time um, another thing to cover real quick is equipment you don't want to just go out and buy the most expensive equipment you got to think about your budget um you know all my money goes to corals it does but you got to think about it and kind of take your time with that you got to get something that's a good quality and that you can carry over to your next tank move you got to manage it just like you got to manage your fire you can't just throw everything into it because it'll burn out the chances are if you're getting into the hobby you're gonna start off with something small you're gonna see if you even like the hobby which you probably will and then from there you're gonna wanna upgrade so you wanna upgrade to something that is gonna be able to carry over to your next tank build a drill tank the chances are if you're like me you probably started off with a tank with no overflow uh, with a hang on back filter and eventually you learn about reefing about drill tanks and sumps and all that good stuff another good thing to do is visit somebody who has a reef tank look them up on facebook somebody might be around in your area join a reef club something something similar visit somebody's tank and see pick their brain see if this is what you want get an idea of what you want to do because you know you gotta that person has to have credentials if they have a crappy looking tank, you might not want to totally listen to them. You know, it does take time and you're always going to be learning, guys. 
So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Drop comments below. I'll help you out. You guys have a good one. Like and subscribe and you guys take care.